So hi, this is a very quick video just about sloping beams with stone. In this instance we're going to make stairs, but it's the same technique for a roof. So obviously you can't just pick up a piece of stone and get a snap point like you can with a full beam. So what I do is I create a structure like this, held up by a single wooden beam, and then I put a reinforcement. That allows me to take the beam away. And then take the reinforcement away. So it falls down. Now you notice that one looks okay. But over here, when it fell down it missed quite a bit. That snap point is way to the right. And that will cause problems if you build on a floor above using that snap point. At best, the wall's going to bulge. At worst, you won't be able to connect beams because it's too far away. And you see, this one's done it as well. You might not notice that at first unless you know what you're looking for. Because you can carry on building. But how to fix it is very simple. You just take a block out. You saw it snap over. Put the block back in. This one looks okay, but I'm still going to do it anyway. And I do that out of habit on every beam. Can just put the stairs in there. But like I say, when a beam drops down, it creates a snap point for a vertical where the beam lands. So if you missed that whilst you were doing the build, and like I say, if you built a floor above it, you'd be using the snap point that's now off-grid. It could cause you a lot of problems. That snap point there is decided where that sloping beam comes down. You can see they're nicely centered now. But I hope that tip is useful, because if you discover that your snap point was wrong, and you've built an entire floor above, you are going to have to delete it. And this is an open plan area I've been working on. Not quite sure what I'm going to build there yet. That's all for now. Bye.